Curly Q&A question of the day. I'm your host, Ken Nichols, and this is Melanie Nichols. She is the founder of the Raw Curls brand of natural and organic curly hair products and also the founder of the Raw Hair Organic Salon in beautiful Naples, Florida. It's one of the top curly salons in the country, and she's one of the top curl specialists. So your question of the day, Melanie, is I don't understand diffusers. I have the textbook curly hair and it should work for me, but it literally does nothing. Diffusing, can you uh, explain it and uh, what it is and maybe a few tips on how to do it? Sure. So diffusing the hair is using an attachment on the end of a blow dryer that softens the airflow so that you're not blowing the hair around too much and mm -hmm. it's helping to dry it gently without causing additional frizz. Um, it helps to enhance the curl many times and make the hair fuller and also to soften that cast that is, you know, on the hair from products, different gels. So I like to use it when the hair is 50 to 80 percent dry or ready. I don't like to diffuse the hair from soaking wet, although some people do. Some people do, yeah. Some people do, and that's fine. Like I said, everyone's got their own techniques. But me personally, I find it's best if the hair is partially dried before diffusing. And then I always recommend to flip the head upside down, and then you're using that diffuser either just above the head and using your hand to scrunch the hair upward, or you can just hold the diffuser above it. You don't have to scrunch it either. But again, I'm, I'm usually trying to enhance the hair and soften that cast. Sure. Um, so it makes it full. You get a fuller, bouncier curl when you diffuse. You get more lift, more volume. So everyone's hair is different. But, um, you know, maybe they're using too high of a heat. Maybe they're over drying with the diffuser. Um you know, the, some of the diffusers have, there's many different forms of diffusers. Some of them have prongs and people like to just gently place that in the hair and, you know, push it up towards the head and just hold it. So there's, you know, again, a variety of techniques. But the most standard type of diffusing that I do is with that type. It's a prong diffuser. Mm -hmm. I also use the Diva hand, the green hand. I do love sure. that one. Um, but I am normally actually taking my hand and using that as a tool to scrunch the hair upward while I'm just holding the diffuser over the hair. Sure, sure. Most times that's how I do it. Okay. Okay, great. Uh, if uh, if you have any questions for Melanie or I, leave them in the comments section wherever you're consuming this content, whether it be Instagram, Facebook, or YouTube, and we'll try to get to it tomorrow. We'll see you then.